So here we are at breakfast again. <laughs> Complete with her at the gas stove. And some horrible child they've brought round and stuck at the end of the table. Where they got him from, I'll never know. Not much of an actor, they said, but he's got a good appetite. Children needs a good start to the day, and that means eggs for breakfast. Just take my little boy. Oh, of course, I might have guessed he's one of yours. He just came in, sat down, and started eating. He hasn't even taken his cap off. Ah, oh, well, that's his uniform. He's a wolf cub. Cub? He eats like a fully grown wolf. He's had four eggs already. I haven't even started. Well, children uses up a lot of energy. And he's growing. Well, he's not growing in my house. Get him out. Vitality is egg-shaped. Come. So if you want your child to have vitality, go out and buy him some eggs. Yes. Don't bring him round here eating mine. <laughs> I'm rather good at crosswords. Trouble is, I make them too easy. Six down, let's see. Down, four letter word beginning with E and ending in S. A valuable food rich in protein. Eggs. I beg your pardon? A valuable food rich in proteins is eggs. It is not eggs, it is eels. It is eggs. It is eels, I've written it down and it fits. But if it was eggs, then seven across would be pig. It is not pig, it is pie. But look at the clue. Pork, and you may hear it grunting. Well, you've heard of a pork pie, haven't you? I've never heard of one grunting. Look. Change pie to pig and pal to dog, oh, and you've good. got eggs. And they're rich in protein and a very valuable food. Good value is egg-shaped. You've completely muddled me up. I'll have to start again now. That's it. Start the day right with eggs. Oh, this is hopeless. Look, I've gone right through the paper. It's your fault. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, here I am back again in that hilarious extravaganza, Hancock at the breakfast table. Supported as usual by a lady doing egg commercials. And to add to the excitement, a broken down carpenter. However, in this day and age, I'm yes. sure... Yes, why not if we... start off the day with an egg? Remember, eggs are quick, cheap and easy. You need an egg for breakfast. Well, why don't you give him one then? He's been round here 18 months putting up two bookshelves. Yes, I know it's ludicrous, bookshelves in a kitchen. Only when he started here, it was a sitting room. He's hopeless, he is hopeless. Feeble, weak, incompetent and useless. Happiness is egg-shaped. And so is rotten bookshelves. So, I shall just have to... Go, go to, to work, work on, on an egg. egg. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, owing to the present state of the theatrical profession, I have with great reluctance been forced to accept a job as a supporting actor to a lady doing a commercial for eggs. <laughs> oh, here she is now. I find as his housekeeper, eggs is easy. Just as well with her cooking them. Eggs is cheap, full of proteins, and what's more, they help you to face up to the day. And to face up to her, I need them. Oh, yes, there's a lot more goodness in eggs than people realise. Happiness is egg-shaped. Pardon? Happiness is egg-shaped. Get a bit of glamour in, they said. Dear, oh, dear. Happiness is egg-shaped. Oh, shut up. Let me get on with my breakfast. And where are my soldiers? You know I can't eat with that... Oh, there we are. Happiness is egg-shaped. Go to work on an egg. Eggs for breakfast. When I agreed to do an egg commercial, I didn't realise what it involved. Eggs is cheap. 
Eggs are easy. They've been round here. They've taken over. Eggs are full of protein. I sold me soul. I'd been bought. Oh, that was nasty. Mind you, I like eggs. What was it they wanted me to say about them? They wrote it down somewhere. Oh, don't mind. I'll think of it while I'm having the eggs. Happiness is egg-shaped. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> For years, my one ambition was to play the violin. But no matter how hard I practiced, I somehow couldn't get the hang of it. Then the other day, the woman from next door looked in. Why don't you have an egg for breakfast? Start the day right with an egg. I don't know why she said that, really, because it was 7.30 in the evening. Anyway, I took her advice. And the following morning, I had two eggs for my breakfast. And you know, I still can't play the violin. But in some curious way, I think it's helped me with the piano. No, it hasn't done that either. Yes, I'm a failure. I shall never play the violin again. Still, once I've had a decent breakfast, I expect I'll learn to live with it. Hey, success is egg-shaped. She's right, you know. As soon as I've eaten these eggs, I'll go and have a crack at the maracas. ha ta 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 Yes, I know eggs are good for you. When I come to Paris, I'd like a change. I always take the continental breakfast myself, the coffee and the rolls. Just look at those two over there. You can tell they're English. Three fried eggs apiece. I don't know why they bother to come to Paris. They might as well get a Frinton. English? No, monsieur. Ils sont français. They are French. French? They can't be. The French don't eat eggs for breakfast. Mais bien sûr, monsieur. Lots of French people eat eggs for breakfast. Do they? Well, in that case, I'll have some too. Three fried ones. Trois. Avec le petit lion. With the little lion. All this week I've been starving myself and I could have had a decent breakfast. You see, monsieur, holidays are egg-shaped. Yes, but you're not, are you? So much for the saucy French waitress. Ah, well. Vive les oeufs. Thank you.